back with another video y'all don't mind my straps because they just keep falling down like i don't got time to keep pulling them back up but today i am going to install another wig so this will be my first time installing a wig i am not a professional and i'm not a hairstylist so do not be trying to come for me okay i do what i can do period but i'm about to tell me show you how i take this one off and then i'm going to be doing this color i colored it myself or whatever but i just blow dry it so it's looking real crazy but um i'm going to show you the colors that i use to get this like auburn i think it's auburn okay you gotta get comfortable but <laughs> Anyways, I'm just going to take a cotton round. I'm not going to talk too much in the video because I'm pretty sure everybody knows how to install wigs. Or whatever. And it's not even a frontal, it's a closure. Oof, Jesus. So the one noise is coming off. Y'all do not mind my um my straight back, so I'm going to wipe this off in the cleanest area. Make sure this area is clean, y'all, because you had that lace on for like a couple weeks. Please make sure that it's clean. Make sure that it is cleaned. And y'all don't mind my vanity because it's it's a mess. when you put the makeup on first it doesn't give this kind of like light part right here but if you do do it first then i mean if you do spray it first and then put the makeup on top then it will do this but if you don't it don't matter to me i do it anyway so once again i am not a hairstylist this is just i'm gonna try this on and see if i need to Put makeup on it or not. But so far, I don't think so. Yeah, I just look crazy right now, but I'm trying to tell you, I know I do. I don't think I need to put makeup on it first, so I'm going to. so i'm gonna spray got to be glue so that the um edges of the hair won't get into when i'm gluing the wig down usually i have my hot comb to do that but y'all my every time i get a hot comb i break it like i don't get it like it keeps happening to me my shit is yeah, this is the glue that i use i should be using the skin protecting but every time i try to get it I can't never get it because it's always gone. And I don't get it why, but whatever. It's always freaking gone, but sometimes I do two layers, sometimes I do one layer, sometimes I do three. But today I'm going to do three layers. I might do the two. I might do three.
square. Make sure y'all like make sure that it's really, really, really clear before you apply the next layer. Do not do what I do because I'm rushing. Like I'm rushing because I'm just fucking tired and I'm not gonna sleep. And I have too much to fucking do in this day. You need to have this bag and you need some alcohol and you need some rice cubes. I'm gonna do this before I um before I let in the glue. So y'all might not see if I but I'm about to take my time and bring this into the glue. Make sure you lay it directly into the glue. What else I messed up on here? Don't be moving glues and stuff all around because you mess it up. I should have put some more like stuff in there to remove this makeup, but I'm gonna just put some makeup on top of it. I'm about to cut this wig off though. And it's only doing that sound because I sprayed the spray on there so it won't get into because this is uh, already cut lace because it's been used before, so that's why I did that. Make sure that you got it on evenly. Just tie this band around. I'll do this like three times throughout this process to um make sure. Oh damn, y'all, it's not going nowhere. Like. It's it's not going nowhere. That bow hole, once you lay the hair down with that bow hole, baby, you better make sure that you got it where you want to go because it's not going nowhere. Now, with the ghost bond, you probably can move it a little bit, but bow hole, baby, that, that bow hole. Let me tell you, I got, um, I got, hold on, can I tell y'all that? So what I'm gonna have to use is um, my curling one to um, to um. I don't have to use my curling one to flatten this out, but I'm gonna take some more alcohol. You don't have to do all of this. This is just because I have sensitive skin. I need to make sure that I don't have no pepper products on my forehead. Cause your girl will break out and I don't have time to be getting all bumpy up in here because they just went away. Let's make sure it's off. But okay, now we gotta make sure this is in the middle before I part the baby out. I don't know why I'm looking at the camera like that. I should have put it and made a part, but frontals are closures and lace is just so tricky. Like when it comes to putting it in the middle, but the makeup is gonna like really, really, really make it in the middle. I'm just trying to make sure that it's like you know, kind of right there, cause I'm going to put. Most to flatten it out. Oh, I'm not. Oh, 
Mm. I can't really tell because of all of these fireworks, but I'm going to um, use the mousse to flatten it out so I can see. Oh, that's the middle. It's mostly making it hard to crumb. And don't put too much mousse on your part because it will make your hair kind of stiff when you flat on it. I don't use a lot of mousse in my hair. I just use it to flatten it out so I can get my, define my part. Because I do not have a hot comb. If I had my hot comb, this would be so much better and I won't have to deal with this. I don't put too much mousse over here. Definitely put too much mousse right there. But this is this is your first time doing lace. Do not be discouraged because I've been doing this for like a quite a minute and you know I still don't have it all down packed, but like baby you gotta keep trying, like trying. Don't let nobody be like, "Oh, your hair look a mess." Like, baby, don't listen to them because this is your first time, and you know you're trying to learn. You know, watch some YouTube videos because that's how I learned. That's exactly how I learned, y'all. I should not put. Oh, that got. Ah, got that got to be glue spray in my hair. Dude. I don't know how to do baby hairs. So don't come for me. Simple. Now that's one thing that's so tricky because I do not know how to do baby hairs. Uh, I was trying to look for my clips because I like to put the band right there. I don't know how to do baby hairs, y'all. I don't, 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 I don't. I commend all hairstylists for knowing how to do baby hairs because your girl don't know how to do that. And I don't do the middle the middle swoop no more. I don't know, I just got tired of doing that because when I used to install my wigs, I was doing the middle swoops. Now I just really like the regular ones. Take this loose again. Is my other phone vibrating? Okay, so I'm about to take this band again. Kind of messed up, y'all. It's so hard to get this band on. It's my time. Usually, I have my hot comb. Now I gotta buy a whole new one. Like <sighs> the struggles. But I'm about to go down this real fast. And see. Okay, y'all so saw the base on the I'm trying to figure out which one do I want to use to define my part. Um, so I like use the silver, but I usually use either this one. And I don't know if I want to use this one because I don't want it to be too light. Mm. Ooh, that hurts. Ow. Mm-hmm. 
I might have used this one for first, then I might even use this powder for the other part. Okay, we're about to see. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna use that. I think that's too light. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna use that. Okay, I think I'm just gonna use my regular powder that I use. Um, Mineral RK by Kiss. I think that's what it said. But okay, no. Comb the mousse out of the hair. you comb the mousse out you don't want your when you flat on it to be stiff so I comb the mousse out okay so the only reason why I'm using makeup is because I did not pluck a straight line so I gotta use some of it now gotta get my baby hair brush because we're gonna try to slay him. I'm all up in the camera. Y'all y'all can tell I'm like like people be trying to cut out certain parts, but this is me. This is the real me. This is what I do. I'm not sure coating nothing. Period. I'm gonna just take this. That was a little bit too thick right there. I had to do a lot. I just don't like big baby hair. Okay. So I like to define my part first so I can see exactly where I went the swoops to be so i'm gonna hope that this goes in the middle got to hope that this line go in the middle because we're taking over a minute so that is Makeup's not dark enough. I should have plucked this part out. Get our head down there. And I'm not the type of person that likes wide parts, so I don't like them big ass or them big parts. I don't even want to start cussing and like looking stupid. I promise not to say another curse word out this video. Yeah, for real. It's gonna take me a minute to I'm just now, you know, stopping. But I'm gonna try. Okay. So I'm gonna take some mousse on the back of my hand. I'm gonna cut these down some. So yeah, it just takes me a while to do baby hair because I don't know how to do this. But we finna God damn, I don't mess the mousse. But we finna finna get it done. Period.
Yeah, it's not working out really. Like, I don't know how people get to sleep. Like, sometimes it works for me, and other days it just don't. Like, I don't have time. I don't. Maybe because, like, always. I don't know. I don't even care. I really don't care. Not my scarf, my little band. And then I'm gonna start flat ironing. Oh yeah, I almost popped my nails. I'm trying to make them last until I get my nails done. I don't even know when I plan on getting them done, but whatever. Shit is about to come off. Y'all don't, I don't tie this tight because I be getting a headache. Like, that's what gives me a headache. But I'm going to be back when I get my flat arms and yeah.
Okay. Wait for this. Let's get hot. I'll put it on the top so. <sighs> y'all be almost done. Y'all almost done. Keep your alcohol by your side because you're going to wipe your skin off after this, even though you're about to go wash your face and stuff. Still keep your put this bag of um, lashes on my Believe it or not, y'all. The only thing I really got on my stand is concealer, one foundation. Oh, I got, wait. I got like five foundation, but I don't use them because they're not my color. But I just been testing colors to see which one is mine. But it's almost there. But yeah, I told y'all I was gonna get this looking crazy. I mean, looking good because you know I was looking real crazy. I was looking like that girl from off holiday, and it wasn't given. So. Now it's giving a little bit. That should always come off like that, but I'm gonna comb this out. But however you do your baby hairs, if you want them to be um like still gel down, I don't care for them because I mean I didn't do it right anyway, as you can see, so I don't care. Plus, when I wash my face, I get my baby hairs wet anyway. I don't matter. And I should have um blow dried my hair more. But <sighs> take some alcohol just to define this part a little bit. Okay. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Make sure to um take some alcohol. It might be a forehead because you know products do break your face out, y'all. So make sure you do that. And I'm gonna cut my baby hairs a little bit shorter. Cause I don't like them in my face. I'll do some edges tomorrow. I don't have time right now. I want to just take a little bit. I don't spray 
it like directly on. I let it fall onto the thing. Just for flyaways, that's it. That's all, I promise, just for flyaways. And now I'm about to tie it down. And y'all, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me how you, how did I do? I'm not a hairstylist. As you can see, I got stuff to work on. But, you know, I make it work for me. Get what I'm saying? I feel like I did good. But, y'all, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we out.